Like no, the song right. and the song I picked off of iTunes or whatever and threw it on for the sake of the, you know, for just to, again, just to have something to hand in right. as a complete thing. And then John Langraff, the guy who runs FX, when he saw it, he said, I think Louie fits into it. He, and also, I didn't know I was going to call it that. I just did that as a thing. And he said, I think Louie fits in. I like the opening. I like the song. He took it as the way the show's supposed to be. <laughs> yeah, you're and then I needed to go filler. get, yeah. <laughs> then I needed to go get this song, Brother Louie, which actually, which, uh, was originally recorded by a band called Hot Chocolate. Mm -hmm. And then it was re-recorded by, uh, the stories. And so we went after it and our legal tiny department. And they said they would give us, well, yeah, there's the publishing and then there's the recording. The yeah. publishing is the actual, like, the song lyrics and the arrangement. And that uh, costs us, we pay $5,000 an episode for that, which for us, wow. $300,000 a $300, show, that's a lot. That's a chunk of that our is budget. A lot. Wait, is that, now, is that the publisher budget. and the artist have to get the same thing, I think? That was a way to prevent Well, some people own Both. separately. Oh, oh, yeah. The master recording is a different group of people because actually hot cho we pay hot chocolate for the publishing or whoever owns their publishing because they wrote it but the stories version is the one that we wanted okay um because of that guy Louis, Louis. ian lloyd that singer the hot chocolate version is like eight guys going Louis, Louis, yeah, Louis. Yeah. it's not as fun <laughs> so we recorded our own version of it um reggie watts was a comic he, oh, yeah, right. he, he did the music for the first half of the season and then we didn't ha have enough to finish it with, and we did it with other people. But he arranged and recorded the um, the, s the music for it that we did, which is almost identical to the stories version. Wow. I think it's a little better. It's just a little nicer. <laughs> and then uh, we did a version where he sang it, where Reggie sang it, and it didn't work. And we tried to think of another way to create that sound, and we couldn't. I was in the studio with Reggie at like midnight because I all the music on this s series I do it with a group of musicians. It's all original music. Wow, Jesus. and uh, the, but the, when we were doing the theme song, it's like I can't. I who how are we going to do this? And then I thought, well, whatever happened to the stories? Like whatever happened to the lead singer? <laughs> so yeah, I went on the internet, doing? yeah, and I what googled the the Ian doing? Lloyd. <laughs> First of all, I, I, didn't, I googled the stories. I don't know who the fuck he was at the time. And I saw, I found a YouTube video of him doing it on American Bandstand, and uh, he, Louis, Louis. <laughs> and so I Googled his name, and Ian Lloyd is just a guy living in New York City, and he has a, a band. It's his son's band, but he's like sings. Jesus. And so I, he's got a little website that he obviously hadn't updated since like 1989 or something, <laughs> and uh, there's an email on it. So it's like midnight, and I write a you know hail mary email hi. I'm a, a TV producer, <laughs> and I want to hire you to do a job. Uh, write me if you're interested. And the next morning, I wake up to an e email. I, this is yes, this is my current please, email. Please, please. This me. is my phone number, and he gave me his phone number. So I call him up, and he's the fucking greatest guy in the world, and he's just happy to still be singing. Yeah. And I kind of asked, sort of carefully, do you still have the pipes to do what you <laughs> yeah, did on the yeah. song? He said, Sure, I do, and. And I told him, look, here's the thing. Oh, cause the, the, the song, we, when we went to try to get it, it was like fucking $20,000 an episode they wanted. For wow. The, for the recording. For the recording of it. And they right. wouldn't back down. And we can't afford it. So I went to Ian and I said, can we just hire you as a singer for a day? That's all I can really afford to do. I have no money for this show. And, uh, he said, well, I need you to pay me enough that I don't want to kill myself. Uh, he said basically, <laughs> I'm happy to do this for you. I just need to have some self-respect, you know. So I offered him some money, and he said, that's fine. And wow. he came, he showed up. It was one of my favorite experiences ever on the show, because he was such a good guy. And he remembered how he recorded it. He remembered, he, there's a couple of tracks, and he harmonized with himself. And he helped us with it. And the only thing, I had him do it exactly the way he did it in the original. And you could, his, his voice is a little older, but I like it that way. Ours is a little different. A little, and also yeah. I asked him to say, instead of Louie, you're going to cry, the second time he says, Louie, Louie, you're going to die. I just asked him to make that one change, <laughs> which he did. Wow. And he nailed it. So we have a version that zero people believe is anything but the original stories version. Without having to pay. Without having to pay that, that, that money, which episode. would be going wow. to Ian Lloyd. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, he probably fucked himself. He fucked, he fucked himself over. No, and I felt bad because when we, I did I Carnegie should. Hall, I had this idea to have him sing sing live to introduce right. me. 
And I thought that would be so cool. And he'd go crazy singing Carnegie Hall. I'm sure he didn't see that coming in his future. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and, uh, but they, the people at Carnegie Hall, if you do music, they charge you like you're the you. fucking Z symphony orchestra. Like, wow. they get, like you're the Philharmonic. So I couldn't afford audience. it, but they printed the programs that says with special guest Ian Lloyd on oh, my, no car <laughs> my Carnegie Collector's Hall. item. <laughs> but, uh, no, nah, he's a great guy. And he, um, yeah. God damn, but there's been people on the internet that are money. like, this can't be the stories version because they, that says you're going to die. And I have the stories version. I've listened to both back to back. They and don't I notice don't... the daughter change, but they notice that <laughs> <Yes>. fucking shit. <laughs> yeah, that's Holy like, could you, Luke, could you have him sing live if you had a recording, or is it just if music's being played? It like was... if you had the music taped? Well, at that point, they, I wanted to have like a little combo band, and then they said that would cost a lot. And then they said, well, you could... Uh, you could do it with playback, and hey. then I said, "Well, I just don't want to do it." So you just mm. you just Look, called for, me out on a lie. <laughs> I really yeah. just kind of backed out on hiring, uh, but I never told him I was going to hire him. For comparison, we got the original. Oh yeah, okay, right Go at the ahead. hook, uh, the All stories right. version. Yeah. A little slower. He's a little grittier now. A yeah. little more in his voice. All right, and then where's what made you think of this song for the show? Thank you, Lord. Danny. You got the uh, the other one. Buddy. What? Oh, you want me? What no, yeah, you got the no, the original from the open. Oh, from the open. Uh, uh, Louis, your oh, version, you your version's way better. I think I you like really it better. You really updated it. Let's see. Here we My go. Bad. My bad. This opening is from the hot chocolate version. They open this way. The stories right, right. version is more '70s stringy in the beginning. Yeah, there's more strings here. Yeah. It sounds almost like... Uh, sounds good. What's the guy who did uh, Fred is Dead? Uh, Fred is Dead. That's what I said. Yes, like yeah. that. Who is that guy? Was this a popular song? Yeah, yeah it was oh, a hit. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Curtis Mayfield, I think. Curtis Mayfield. The, the music is a little Curtis Mayfield. Wow. That strings... Da -da -da -da. Wow. I... Louis. Louis. I always thought that the, uh, I thought that was the original lyric. No, until right this moment, doesn't exist in the original. That's fucking. Yeah. That, your version's way better. I just I love him. This crooning singer saying, "You're gonna what a, die. What a, You're gonna cry." What a great anecdote. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, usually those back back scenes things are boring. That, that was a pretty no, good that one. was very. You uh, fucked that guy over. Oh, man, you totally <laughs> really <laughs> fucked him over with his help. He was so fucked <laughs> with his help. Yeah. Yeah. He has horrible he representation. Start getting he would start getting checks from ASCAP. <laughs> right. He'd become they'd become it every time every the show time was on show Netflix. Everything. Fucking DVD. Boom, boom. Oh, Instead, he got a day rate. You had such a great experience with the guy, but you fucked him no, over. No, I, I. <laughs> Oh I owe uh, Ian Lloyd. He's a good man. He, I always get emails from him when he's in town and stuff. Put him in an episode. <laughs> he's a good man. No, I, I'm going to. He also <laughs> wants to act, too, so I'll put him in something. How old is he? Uh, I have no idea. I don't is he black know. or 50s, white? 50s, 50s. White guy. Oh, okay. yeah. Scrawny white guy. Yeah. With a vo Nobody has that voice. I mean, that's, no, that's, that's a testament to what he did. That fucking 30 years later, I couldn't find anybody that, that could replicate that sound. That's There's no white guy. That is amazing, yeah. No, I don't, what is that? Yeah. <laughs> what kind of, there's no, it's not soprano or something. It's, it's just, heroin. Yeah. Oh, that's him right there? <laughs> yeah. Hey, he looks all right. Hey, listen, so, uh, he's Hoffman. awesome. Why don't we take a break? Fish boat, fishing captain. <laughs> Louis, uh, you're going to make it to the end with us, or do you got to go? Yeah, somewhere? I'll hang around. Okay, good. Louis C.K.